Hey guys, Neil here from Red Rep Low Face. I'm doing next section of my Y stage installation into the Prussia Mendel. For this one, you're going to need your Y stage motor, NEMA 17, 17 ounce, uh, 75 ounce at least. Um, if you can swing it, get one that already has your wires hooked up and long leads. If not, you'll have to create your own long leads in your own clip. Uh, you're going to need a um, motor pulley. You can either use the printed version or you can use a aluminum one. The aluminums are cheap, printed ones are just as good sometimes. Uh, you're going to need three M3s to attach the motors. You're going to need um, your fasteners for holding down your clips, whatever length you're using. Again, I try to do all my, or I try to do this version of the Mendel with all one length, uh, 25 millimeter or um, one inch, just depending on which version you're putting together. Um, first thing we're going to do is go ahead and install your motor here. You should have already put your nut into here and your grub screw. You're going to want to drill a flat onto this. Um, when you're drilling a flat, it's going to produce metal shavings. You do not want the metal shavings getting inside your separate motor. And my very high dollar solution for keeping stuff from getting in there is dollar store silly putty. You take it and you stuff it into the edge of the motor like this. Off the rest, just fill that little hole right there. Do whatever shaving you need to do to the motor to get a flat and then pull it off and reuse it a thousand times. That's how I do it. But anyway, you get your flat, you go ahead and install your pulley onto your motor right up to the body of the motor and you tighten down your grub screw. So that should not move. Then install your stepper motor. Into the Y motor bracket. Using your M3 screws. Remember to use washers, because you always have to use washers whenever you're putting a bolt against your plastic, or a nut, forget, bolt, against your plastic parts. For this particular version of the Y motor mount, you only have three screws. The other version works just as good as this one does. It just has more plastic mass to it. But as far as functionality, the standard sales Mendel version of the Y motor mount works just as good if that's what you end up having. Bring this back over. Make sure that these this is straight up and down as it is. Okay, now the next thing you're going to want to do is make sure that this pulley and that pulley over there are directly in line with each other. Um, you can either do that by eye or if you're obsessive like me, you can measure from the middle of the round to the beginning of the pulley because you know these two are parallel. So that's 65 millimeter from center to the inside of the pulley. And this one is Center line. There we go. That's 
65. So now we can go ahead and take our belt. This is actually a belt from an older build of a sales bindle that I did that I ended up taking apart and selling to find the hobby. is for that belt clip to go right down the middle there. Like that. And what I generally do is go ahead and cut the belt so that they don't actually they don't actually have to be really close to each other. Just as long as they hook around the motor. the clip on this side to there and then this one only needs to be that long so open it up a little bit use whatever size nut and washer you're using using number six Imperial or you, you might be using the M force if you're using the metric. But as usual it doesn't matter which one you use. So you have your belt clip there. nice and tight. I had so many complaints about the music earlier and the double speed, so everyone was complaining about my editing. Now you're being subjected to the alternate, which is not enough editing. So you just got to spend 20 sec 25 seconds of your life watching an idiot try to screw something in.
this actually, this one little piece of wood actually replaces the squished frog. And you notice it's not tight enough at this point, so what I do is you want to actually tighten from the side that's away from the motor. Loosen it up. Pull it taut. your wax stage. The only way it's going to move now is with a stepper. Which now it's quite stiff. That is actually being moved by the stepper. So there we go. This part now basically your wax stage is completely done. Now we'll go ahead and move on to your X stage.